to my very awkward intro. My name is Susan slash Bambi and this is Bambi's Rambles. How cute is this thing? Got it for a dollar at the op shop. We're not in our usual spot today because... And how cute is this from the op shop? And how cute is this from the op shop? And I also got, excuse me, with my hair, this from the op shop. So this is just a random rambles, not in our usual spot. We're in the, the old lounge, the old TV room. I don't really sit out here very often, but here we are. And there's going to be a real random rambles. From Bambi's Rambles. Jose is currently making a cheese platter. And I'm excited about it. And I'm holding my microphone because I want to be a little like... I'm a news presenter. You know, a bit like the paparazzi. Is there anything you'd like to say? Okay. Is there anything you'd like to say? Everyone say hi to Bunny. Jose is watching. What are you watching, Jose? Unit 522. Unit 522, which is a YouTube channel which talks about scary stories. And here's something I prepared earlier. Precisely. I want to talk about a multitude of things today and how that I have lost my funny. I have misplaced the funny. I don't know where the funny is. I don't know where the humor is. It's long gone. I'm trying to break the slump I'm in. I'm normally a very humorous fellow, but not today. Went and brought a picnic basket today from the upshop because I've decided that maybe if I have picnics, it'll make me go want to go outside more. So I'm going to start vlogging me picnics. The flies are all out and about. This is number one reason why I hate living in the bush. They just appear out of nowhere. But, um, I have lots to say about a multitude of topics today. One being, why the hell is Playmate Tess on Dr. Phil? Dr. Phil, stop. Stop. Stop trying to be with the cool kids, mate. You're a fake therapist and I highly doubt you've helped anybody except line your own pockets. You have been known that you do not have an active license for therapy you have been accused of sa you have made dumb people famous you have traumatized guests on your channel on your channel out here like it's a youtuber on your fucking show like you're a joke and you need to stop you're not helping mental health you're hindering it you're turning it into a goddamn circus. So cut that shit out. Hang on, the dog's upset. I'll be right back. Hello, this is my first guest on the Dr. Bambi show. She's been known to have an obsession with a toy named Bunny. She's also been known not to eat her dinner. She's funny. She's sassy, but she rejects all form of relaxation and sleep. Her name is, please welcome to the stage. What's your name? Luna. Luna? And how old are you, Luna? Three. Three? Are you shy? I'm a little bit. You're a little bit shy? Yeah. Yeah. What's your favorite color? Pink and blue. 
purple. Pink and purple. My favourite show is Peppa Pig. Your favourite show is Peppa Pig. Look, I this is my show. I ask the questions. All right. Yeah. Get your grubby paws off it, child. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and who's your best friend? Mummy. And who's mummy's best friend? Me. Yeah. Are we best friends forever? Oh, and Bunny's your best friend? Yeah. Should I, should I interview Bunny? What's what's Bunny's concern? Uh, Does Bunny have any concerns? No. No concerns? Mm -mm. Okay. Do you have any concerns? Uh, yeah. yeah. what are your concerns? I don't know. You don't know? Look, I don't know either. Very common not to know. Please welcome to the stage... Bunny. Now, Luna. Bunny would like to say something. Uh, what would Bunny I like to say? Uh, she likes flowers. She likes flowers? Uh, I like flowers. Oh, Bunny likes flowers. Bunny, do you have any concerns? No. No, no. Okay. That's okay. Luna, we're going to take a quick ad break. Would you like to join us again or would you like to exit the stage? I want to join. You want to join me? Mm -hmm. Do you have a magical remedy for flies? A fly egg. Yeah, but do you know how to get rid of the flies? No. No? Oh, you go like that? Oh, okay. Is that is that what they call a um, karate chop? No? What do they call it? You don't know? Uh, yeah. Okay. Please stay tuned for the next segment of Bambi and Friends. Dr. Bambi. This is Dr. Bambi show. The Dr. Bambi show. I can almost guarantee you it's better than Dr. Phil. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned. Now a word from our sponsors. Welcome back to the Dr. Bambi show. And this is your host, Susan. In our next segment we will be eating cheese and crackers and breadsticks and a whole bunch of other shit that's not healthy. But we will be having a special guest, special guest appearance from the one and only Jose. But until then, I'd also like to talk about Gabby Hanna. Gabby. Honey, you weren't trolling. Stop doing that. Stop. Because you were not trolling. You were trying to convince everybody that you weren't out of control because we go through these spirals. We go through these things where we're a mess and we do questionable things and we embarrass ourselves and then we feel guilty. We feel uncomfortable. Sometimes the uncomfortable feeling is so deep that you literally want to crawl out of your skin. I'm guessing what that's what Gabby Hanna is going through. And now she wants to play the troll card, so it makes her feel better. My cup is on the bench. Please stay tuned for the next episode. Hello, welcome back to the Dr. Bambi Show. Please welcome our second guest, Jose. Hello. Hello. How are you? <laughs> I'm good. How are you? I'm good now. I've eaten. You've eaten? You mm. good? Okay. How do you feel about the latest controversy between... The Duggars? Didn't he get arrested? Look at him keeping up to date. By the Federales? <laughs> How do you feel about this, this, um, this developing story? You get what you get and you don't get upset. <laughs> <laughs> Luna, how do you feel about Katie Joy's coverage of the Duggars? <clears throat> Is that the crystal ball lady? Yeah. Has she found the crystal ball yet? Look, we're still on the hunt and <laughs> that, that will be that will be an exclusive we'll have later this week. Katie Joy. 
Jose, what were the soccer scores last night? What league? Any. Chelsea won 2 0. Yep. Top four finish for the boys. Yep. You're a sports commentator. Liverpool and Man United got postponed because of the scumbag Liverpool supporters that want to invade the pitch and try and voice their opinions about their owners. It's not your, it's not your stadium. It's not your game to do it at. Do it in your own time. But you can't expect more than fans that live in rubbish bins, yeah? A.K.A. Oscar the Grouch. Yeah. Liverpool's a grouch. My hair looks a bit like Big Bird today. What do you reckon? Who are you? Dr. Count Countria? 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 Count Dracula. Count Dracula! Thank Scandula. you. Scandala. Huh? Scandala. La Scandala. Ask me a question. I'm on a time limit. I've got another interview after you. Well, they're paying you more than I am. No, you're not paying me at all. Well, what are they paying you? More than what you are. Do you know how to brush your daughter's hair? No. <laughs> Do you know how to brush your hair? I don't know if anyone can hear that, but Luna's watching YouTube Kids. What's on YouTube Kids today, Luna? Uh, baby, baby Shark. Yeah. Baby John. Baby John? Yeah. Like John Munch? <laughs> baby John. <laughs> From Lauren Ordo's for you. What a name. I thought people named John and Paul and Peter and Kyle were named after they turned 15. That's when you name them their names. They're baby, they ba baby seven two one four. Baby, baby X Y and Z until they're they're of age. Like, oh, you're Kyle. <laughs> When's your birthday? Fourth of July. What's Big your favorite pie. color? Purple. Purple. What country were you born? El Salvador. Do you often chew with your mouth full? Eat with your mouth full. Talk oh, with your mouth full. Yeah, often chew with your mouth full. <laughs> Talk with your mouth full. It's the only way to chew when you got something in your mouth. Do you often... I'm malfunctioning. Do you often talk with your mouth full? Yeah. Is that a thing? Yeah. If you don't like it, you get what you get. And you don't get upset. I'm back. Oh, you're back. Welcome back, Luna. Is there any final words you'd like to say? Something like like and subscribe to my mum's channel? Say, like and subscribe to my like, mum's channel? like, like, and subscribe okay. to Bandy Rambles. <laughs> say, I'm exploiting my, my children. Say, uh. eat my shorts. Yeah. So eat my shorts, your bananas. <laughs> no. <laughs> Why not? Oh, you're so beautiful, Luna. But this was just a little bit of bit Any of fun questions? we could have this afternoon. No, because we're gonna go pick up our children from the school. Was well, that it? Yeah. You brought me all the way from Cali for this. Oh, from your more important interview. Yeah. What? Well, were you going to the Doctor Phil show? I have Joe Rogan. Daddy. I have Andrew Schultz. Daddy, why do you say that? Yeah, say, Daddy, you're silly. You're silly. I have to talk to them about my new flamethrower that me and Elon Musk created. See that? I don't know where I found him, but I don't have a receipt to return him. If you're interested in one of my flamethrowers, send me an email. <laughs> well, I thought we were going to have a word We've from our sponsor. We've only made 500 of them. So get your hands They up. are the sponsor of get this video. Get your hands on while they're hot. While they're Let hot. <laughs> while they're hot, back of a truck. <laughs> they're going to be called the... Uh, or they're hot because they're a flamethrower. The fiery do you fire. Have, do you have the money? <laughs> they're going to be called... Do you have the money and the capacity to deal with the third the third degree burns that you're going to be placing on my Before viewers? you buy them, you have to sign a waiver saying that anything you do with this flamethrower doesn't come back on us. It is completely up to you. Whoever you burn, whatever you all, burn. All, all it will say on there is you get what you get and you don't get That's upset. It. As long as you sign that, then 
We're done and done. <laughs> are they going to be called the Fiery Fiery 500? Luna, what are you doing, honey? <clears throat> fiery Fiery 500. And you don't have to have a license to use them. You just... Why am I holding like it like this when he's the one yakking <laughs> you on? You just pull the trigger and you burn away. I can think of a top of my head, 10 people that I'd like to use them on today. Just today alone. That's just, aggression! Just bear a minute. It's not aggression. You get what well, you get, you don't get upset. Thank you for coming to a random rambles slash Elon Musk and Jose sponsored tutorial on how to get rid of flies. You know how do you get rid of flies? Who named them flies anyway? Like what? They could have thought of a better name. Like the guy, the guy who looked at flies just thought, "Oh, look, this thing's fly." Okay, Luna. We're gonna name him Fly. What's a Marty McFly? <laughs> what about? Just it could have come up with a better name, to be honest. What would you a have fly. called him? I don't know. I don't want to. Well, you're judging people, but uh, you've got nothing to a, come back it up. I would have called him a buzzy wuzzy. A buzzy wuzzy. A buzzy wuzzy. It's better than a fly. It's more... It's, it's more... It's, it's got more... Pizzazz. It's more pizzazz. More essence to it. <laughs> Imagine just sitting there like, you're this big high up thing. And like, you're naming insects. You're like, oh, that one flies. I'm going to name it a fly. I would have sacked you right there and then, on the spot. I would have called him sacked. You would have called him sacked? And this thing right here is the biggest fly of them all. She's a buzzy wuzzy. So, thank you for watching this completely and utterly random rambles that probably had no point whatsoever. But I hope it made you laugh because it made me laugh. Catch me on Joe Rogan, Andrew Schultz. Mm. Buy my new flamethrower. Love you. Bye. What's your name? <coughs> Rina Valencia. And here you are, how old? We've already asked those questions, Dad. Yeah. When yeah. I come on a show, it's my show. Oh, do you want to do the exit <laughs> speech then? Be, be me. Go, do it. So, guys, I hope that you enjoyed us talking about X, Y, and Z. Now you're the you know, best. as we always say, we got to keep that same energy. I love you. Marlo, love you, Marlo. <laughs> Steph, hi, Steph. Steph. Love you guys. I'll see you on the next episode of Bambi's Rambles. Now I'm just rambling. Mwah. Love you guys. Like and subscribe. Now I'm just... I need to end this thing. Love you guys. What like about it. pumpkin? <laughs> Love you guys. Like and subscribe and hit the bell and keep up to date with my videos. <laughs> Love you, pumpkins. <laughs>